If you want to use Ecamm Live with ProPresenter 6, there's a couple of hoops you need to jump through, but once you get those sorted out, then it's pretty straightforward. So, first off, what I'm going to do is go into ProPresenter Preferences. Now, you can do Command, Comma in the Mac version. In fact, this has to be the Mac version for all these tricks to work, but Ecamm Live is only Mac software, so we're going to just assume we go that way. So go into Preferences right there, and now we need to select Display. By default, these are the settings that you're going to see. You might notice this checkbox didn't know what it did in the past. Enable Siphon captures the output of ProPresenter and sends it to other software on the same computer in this case, Ecamm Live. So let's make sure that we enable that. Now, what if you'd like the background to be transparent? Well, you see the screen color option over here? Let's go ahead and select that. Here, let me drag that over because normally that's on another screen. And you'll notice the opacity is set to 100%. We actually want to set that to zero. And when we do that, notice that this background gets gray, just like this output goes gray. So that should be set and ready to go. So I'm going to go ahead and select this background here. This is um, my lower third. So I'm going to move this out of the way. And here you see me. Hi. Hi. When you put your mouse over here, you'll notice that you have now an additional option that says ProPresenter 6. That is the siphon overlay. So now I can click this. This isn't the registered version, so we will see the watermark. But if you've got the registered version of Pro 6, you won't see that. So click there, and there's the watermark I told you about. But when I remove my mouse, you can see my lower third. And if I go back into ProPresenter, then I can pull that out. So it works just like uh, anything would in ProPresenter. Just straightforward, regular stuff. So that's how to do it on the same Mac. But what if you've got Ecamm Live on a different Mac than you're running ProPresenter? Well, try this. Do everything the same way that I showed you just a second ago. But then what we're going to do is we're going to download a little piece of software called NDI Siphon. Let me hide, out, hide my face because I find that a little distracting. So NDI Siphon, as it fires up, we're going to go down here to this bottom section. This top one is goes from NDI to Siphon. This bottom one goes from Siphon, which remember we have coming out of ProPresenter to NDI. So I'm going to enable that, and then I'm going to select the Alpha Channel choice here. Once I do that, then in Ecamm Live, I'll have the NDI option. You'll see it's up here as NDI as well, but we can go back in here, and now we have this option. Here, let me disable the siphon output. Let's once again select my nameplate and go to this, select that, just exactly the same. So that's how to use Ecamm Live with ProPresenter 6 to put um, the output of ProPresenter over at Ecamm Live.